Greetings, Cosmos, and welcome to the Seven Worlds of Challenge by Nyan MC. I'm starting for I'm starting recording from here just in case it auto it auto starts with something. Oh, guess not. Well then, hold on. I'm going to go deafen some background noise. There we go, background noise should be dampened. The adventure begins! I hope this works on 2.0. It just occurred to me that I didn't check to make sure it wasn't a 38A episode. Oh well. Hmm. I want to just slide. Here. Hey, tiny turtle! Well, this is... I like the music. Right off the bat, loving the exit music for the uh, tape. Hmm. Alright. Windy Hills. Bloop. I was promised Windy Hills, what am I doing inside a lake? Ah! Okay. Where does this take me? Hey, Toad! Ooh! There's Lava Head, use this. Oh my. I like this already. Ha! Ah, I'm taking it with me. Oh. Hmm. Oh, I missed the tape. So, already. This is reminding me of the previous Yawn MC episode I played, where each level is a short little vignette. Mundane forest. Oh, hey! If you're Mario, you can descend into the abyss. Oh! That's intended to let. Whoa! That I did not expect! Clever. So, an abyss that you can fall into if you are Mario, but no one but the shell that's chasing you cannot. Clever use of those tiles. Alright, Peach's Castle. So. Hey, Toad, what is up? Be careful out there. Wait, that. I'm gonna get that tape and then I'm gonna come back and challenge the actual castle. The levels in this episode are already feeling a little on the short side, but they're enjoyable. And I'd really rather have levels that are too short than levels that are too long. Hey, everyone! Mario, it's terrible! The world is highly unstable! Well, yeah, anyone can reach in and change it anytime they please. I can reach in and change it. Mario, the universe is out of- is not at balance. Some cat-like creature has modified the land and made it very difficult for you to progress. The toads have managed to keep the balance of the Mushroom Kingdom, but not for long. Quickly, save the world before it's too late. Some cat-like creature? Is that a joke about the creator of this episode? <laughs> I love it. Alright. Mushroom Mountains. Oh my. Oh, that that's not what I wanted at all. 
I messed up. I like the death music. Okay, so I need to move quickly. What am I doing? Woo! Okay, made it. Ah! Yeesh! Nope. Nope. Eh. Okay, okay. Gotcha! Ha! Okay, done. That level was stressful. Had it gone too, on too much longer, I might have died and had to start the whole thing over again, and then started to slowly get frustrated. Well, frustrated. Alright, airship of enemy spam. Oh no. Enemy spam is usually a bad thing, but I have learned not always. Well, this isn't spam yet. Whee! Oh my. Well, that was short. This, the name prepared me for a level that was going to be much more difficult. Alright, and so now I go into Neon Wall Type V. I have made a breakthrough. What if I take the Neon Wall, make it vertical, and fill it with lava? Oh no! So Type V stands for vertical, huh? Hello, you. Oh no, the backs of my ankles. Alright, I like that this level starts you off part way up already. Or part way up the screen. Ha! So what's this do? Wow, you're actually a bit more skilled than I would have expected. Woo! I escaped the lava. Well, that's quite a distance between worlds. Check it out, I'm hanging out in the void between worlds. Woo! Desert Beach. Ah! I don't know how that happened without me dying. Oh my. I was going to try and kill these spinies, but then I realized what a terrible idea that would be. Oh no. I just might die. Okay. Grrr! With something this simple, there's no way it's anyone's fault but my own. Ah! Every time! Alright. What if I do this? Huh? Yeah! Hey, Thwomp, I'm taking the upper path. Oh! Nice! And so I need to take the lower path if I am to get the secret of it. Actually, I'm not sure which of those exits is the secret of it. The other exit. Aha! Eighth one. Yeah! Well, that level was sufficiently challenging. Oh, what's down here? Enemy infestation. Wee! There could have been an antlion down here and I would never have known until it was too late. I think you can program something like that in using with Oh my. Using Lua. Whee! Okay, I made it. Hey turtle, I need your shell. Remember how I said I'm not going to 
easy on you this time, this is where I begin to make things harder. Now, I'm gonna toss that shell. Wah! Okay. I made it! Woo! I made it. Ooh. Ruined village. Hey, you. Tell me things. This was once the Babam village, until it was destroyed. Did the Babams get mad and blow up at each other? We lost everything. Our homes. Our families. Mario, you are our only hope. Can you survive the evil here and destroy it? The exit is on the right. Alright, here we are. The coin-filled desert. I should have read that sign before I collected the coin. Oh, oh look, it's me. Yep, I did sign bad to coins. It's best not to touch them. How do I make that jump? I mean, this is an interesting challenge, but that one coin is just mean. Okay, okay, I made it. Hiya! Ara! Woo! That was scary. Hiya! Ara! Meow. <laughs> Doggy, stop! Okay. Okay, now what's further on here? Oh, the exit. Again, a tough challenge, but it's short, so I can weather it. Every time I think I'm going to get to that star, there's another level. Random water hell. Hey, sign, tell me things. I hope you like fish and hard to navigate areas. I like neither of these things. Is this music from... Oh, come on, what's that Zelda game? Breath of the Wild. Oh my, those fish got stuck together. They were trying to shake fins, but their fins are short. What if I go... What if I go up? What if the fish were bees? Ah. Ah. This is a hard to navigate area. Because of the fish! Curse you fish! Oh. Woo, this is a stressful area. Yay, lives! But at least it's short. This episode really amped up the difficulty. Battle with Nyan? Oh, hi Nyan. Oh, there you are. I'm the cat-like cre creature everyone was talking about. This time, instead of using machines to do all the work, now I get to watch close up and see what the hell I'm doing wrong. Okay. Oh, hey. Take that. Oh. Oh, I missed. I missed. I need to actually jump for this boss, don't I? I need to jump a little bit higher than that. Yeesh! I like how simple this boss is. Two Rinkas would be a pain in the butt to deal with if the boss was, you know, any more complicated. Which is why whenever I have the chance, Against more complicated bosses, I just scroll the Rinka shooters off the screen. Take that, Metroid aesthetics. Oh! Oh! I'm so dumb, I should have gotten more attacks. I'll be back and stronger. Oh, I collected something. Well, uh, join me next time as I continue exploring?
Question mark? Yeah, yeah, join me next time. I'll see you then. <laughs>